Hello and welcome back to a new Pizza Array Geometry Node Setup. Today I will show you how you can easily create a LED wall. Let's go! Okay, here we are in the Blender file now. And as you can see, we have two different LED setups. Uh, one is only for images and animations. And the other one is only for um, yeah, typographic stills or animations. So, and both setups has the same settings. So let me show you this here really quick. Um, yeah, you can adjust uh, the LED size um, of this one. And by the subdivision tab, you can increase or decrease the amount of LEDs. And if you need some yeah, high res LED stuff, you can use here these super subdivisions. Yeah, um, as I said, this setup is only for um, images and animations. And if you select here this LED, um, this LED here, um, you can adjust the, the texture on uh, the LEDs here um, by simply yeah, changing here um, the texture. I created three different templates for um, the screens, uh, which has the um, yeah the right aspect ratio. And but if you are um, if you are putting a texture here inside which will not fit, you can adjust this texture here by using um, yeah the mapping node. Okay, let's go to um, the typographic stuff. As you can see, the text uh, fits perfectly into the LED grid here. The setup for this one is different or a little bit different. Um, if we select here the, the LEDs, there are, there's no texture on it, but you can change the texture here in the uh, texture texture properties tab and if you are uh, yeah, selecting here another template or another texture um, yeah this one will change here and if again I made uh, three templates for this one um, if you put a texture here inside with an another aspect ratio you can adjust this by um, going into UV edit here in the LED, uh, in the UV edit, you have to go into the, um, yeah, into the edit mode, select all faces by pressing A, and you can go here into the UV editing se section, make sure that you have select UV sync selected on, and then you can, by scale up or scale down, or, yeah, move them this here one around you can adjust here the texture on it <clears throat> if you need to but there's an option and you can do this by the way if you want to change the color of the leds you can find this one here on led off that's the dark one and led on you can here change the color if you're wondering how you can create here um some animation animated textures for your leds i created three different uh, templates in blender as well and as you can see here this is a tiny setup or okay sorry this is a tiny setup here um yeah where you can change the text and uh, do your adjustments and render this one out here and then um, you can Put this texture here into uh, into the LED stuff here. Okay, if you want to create um, your LED grid from scratch, um, you have to keep some stuff in mind, and that is that you have 
uh, even number of columns and rows. So let me show you this really quick here by uh, this white LED. And as you can see, as you can see, I um, loop cut, I loop cut it <laughs> the um, the uh, um, LED here five times, uh, five times of this plane here. So um, uh, let me explain this here really quick. So if we want to make this plane a little bit wider, maybe we uh, put this one from one to three. So we have, um, uh, we expanded the size uh, one time, so um, we have this quad two times in uh, yeah, and this screen here now. So and, and when we um, when we are putting here uh, our geometry node setup on this one and um, yeah, select this here. <clears throat> you can see then when we increase in the subdivision we don't have an even number of columns so and we can fix this by loop cutting here this one in uh, the half as an escape here now and now you can see that we have an even grid now so that is uh, that is the one thing that you have to keep in mind if you are creating uh, your own LED stuff here. Okay, and if you want to make an image um, uh, here, an image uh, thing, an image LED, you have to add a skin modifier and add here a texture from this one maybe. And now you can see uh, you have a little LED here. You can adjust this one here. Maybe scale this one a little bit down. Yeah. And that was the Geometry Node LED setup. I hope this one will help you. And if you have any questions, please let me know. Uh, you can find this one on Blender Market or on Gumroad. See you next time and bye bye.